now we are going to go hiking with Mr. Fram, and guess what? Hopefully this guess time. Guess what? Shh, hopefully this time he will. This boy right here will not fall into the water. So yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, Jaden will not fall into the water this time, and it'll be better than last time. Show them the trip. And this is where we're going, and I have no idea which way. Okay, this way it is. Do you want to walk? Yeah. Okay. Hello, and that's it. Stay nice and low, y'all. Hey, how y'all doing? Good, how are you? Good. Is the river far from here? It's literally all the way down at the bottom. Alright, thank you. You're welcome. Alright, slow down, guys. What'd you say? Woo! It's a little steep here, but... There you go. Stay low. Keep your knees bent and stay low, okay? There you go. I gotta coach him how to do it. Somebody's missing. She know herself. Right, Zah? Somebody's missing, right? No, what? Somebody's asleep uh -oh, instead of being here. Uh-huh. Are you recording? Yep, I'm recording, y'all. So let me show y'all real quick. Pan view real quick. Yeah, really, like... really pretty over here, actually. So we basically... Woo. Nice and green. I'm coming. I'm just trying to get some some footage. All right, come on. Let's go. Let's go. I'm gonna get y'all on camera today. Interesting. And we came up from that way, kind of steep. Y'all got it? Mom, you can this way. Stay nice and low, nice and low, and keep your hands red in case you lose balance. Hey, how y'all doing? Good. Keep going, guys. Keep The Patasco Valley State Park is historically known as Maryland's first state park and is maintained by the Maryland Department of Natural Resources. The Patasco Valley State Park was formed in 1906 with the indoctrination of the Forest Act. The Patasco River extends for about 32 miles, covering an area of roughly 16,043 acres of land across roughly four different cities in Maryland. It starts from the historic Ellicott City and empties all the way to the eastern part of Maryland in, into the Chesapeake Bay. The Patasco State Valley Park has over 70 identified trails and 200 miles in total of just trail land. Some of the trails include mountain biking, 
picnics, fishing areas, hiker trails, and cookout areas as well. The park has six distinct areas, which include the following. The McKeldin area, the Daniels area, the Hollowfield area, the Pickall area, the Hilton area, and last but not least, the Avalon Artney area. The Hilton area is actually the Ellicott City side, which is where this video was shot and is mainly found in Catonsville, Maryland. So this is the Potasco River. See what the kids are up to. Um. What y'all doing? Skip it, bro. I'm trying to find So coming down here took us about about 15 20 minutes about 15 minutes pretty decent um we just have enough light so we, we could we could see a pretty pretty good uh, pretty good picture right now hopefully i'll get some error shots but yeah man um i think this is definitely a good a good place to come through if you want to come just see how the river is take some kids down here and just have a little adventure there's some people along the side of the river. They went all the way down there. I'm not sure how they got there, but the river is kind of rough, so you gotta watch your feet. The McKeldin area is the park's most western section and is comprised of horseback riding, mountain bike trail, um, a regular uh, walking trail, as well as disc golf course. The river in the McKeldin area also allows you to fish if you wish to fish and it also has some rapids which are um, on the Riverside. The Daniels area is comprised of the Daniels Dam, which provides smooth water for canoeing as well as fishing and some swimming. Hollowfield area is the park's center section, which has over 73 campgrounds and trails. It consists of small campgrounds with mini cabins. And, and a nature center for children as well as playgrounds now some of these mini cabins are available for rent and you can pretty much go to their website and rent a trailer or a mini cabin for the weekend for a small fee for just you and your family and finally the last section of the Patasco Valley State Park is called the Avalon Artney area which basically features the historic site of this park which is the Thomas Viaduct and the former dam called Blodes Dam. 